ended up letting John in. I I had the screen door locked, and then company was with him, so I, yeah. And then I fed the cat, so I did everything at the same time. It's good. We're, we're okay, but we're back. And uh, so, yeah, we are, I forget what we're looking for. We're, we're trying to figure out where Anna is. I don't like her. Her face looks weird. Um, I've never ever held a fidget spinner. Did I miss my window? Dear Lord. Anna, Anna, can I like click on uh, no? No. People up oh, there we go. There's my profile. That's what I want to see. All right, well, that's boring as fuck. Lover of animals, of life animals, and working at Faraday Safety. Okay, so. So. Oh. Wait. One minute ago. Is it like a million degrees out there? Or is it just me gonna chill at home for now? This was a minute ago. What? Hello? Uh, how do I? Ooh, okay. Cleavage! How do I? Okay. How's the nuclear launch codes going? <laughs> yes, thank you. Sorry, I just abruptly came back and I was like, ah, the game's on and I got distracted and started playing. I, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Okay. Uh, no one needs to know what happened. Something weird just happened. Greg, you got through Jabber? What do you see? She literally just made a new post. Awesome. Send it to me. That's her place. So she's at home? Then why isn't she answering? Maybe she's still there. Should have known. I'm gonna... I'm going there to have a look. It's gonna take a while, so stay put. Okay. What's this? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hang on. Ashley is so adorable. We were on the phone for hours, and I only said, like, two words. And like a good bestie, I sat through the entire thing. I don't know what it is about her and guys. She's always, I don't know, self-conscious about it? I'm not like that with Greg. Should I be? I mean, he's been good to me, I guess. Okay. Okay, so these videos are still syncing. Because her data got recovered. Hey, hey, need your help. Saw your Jabber post and looks like you're home. I want to check something. Anything for you, babe? Well, since when you call people babe, remember... I told you about my watch. Can you check if it's at your place? I can't seem to find it.
Where did you last put it? Check by the sink? Remember taking it off in the bathroom. Can't find it. No worriers. Just let me know if you see, okay? Jesus. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, oh lord, oh lord, god damn. Ah! Things are happening on this phone! I need your help to get a new replace. Anna blocked my card. So immature. So to get my copy to work, I need to register as a guest, but they need an authorization code, and it has to be done through Anna's phone. Greg shared Tech Titan's contact. This is a security company you have to text. People use this to request temporary access for house guests. Send the code when you get it. Make sure you enter my full name. Don't make me wait. I don't know your full name, dude. Go away. Uh, Greg. 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 Greg Summers. Okay. So. Hello? Um. Oh. Uh. Hello, Anna. How can we help? Invite guest or unblock. Invite. Or wait. Do I have to unblock? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Unblock. Uh. Maybe unblock. Unblock. Uh. Shit. Shit. What is your what, what what is your God damn it I I don't know I Invite guest. Greg Summers. Okay. There we go. There's your code. It works in the lift now. Can't believe my card won't work anymore. She gave me this on our first anniversary. Said I earned a frequent flyer card. God, I hope she's home. Okay. Okay, I'm at her doorstep now, but something's wrong. What? I can hear someone inside. Doesn't sound like her. I'm going in. Oh god, is it me? Be careful. Something's wrong. There was this voice or sound. 
fuck I am recording this. Must be Toby. That's strange. I don't see Toby anywhere. Find the source of the post? On her bed? Her laptop is still warm. It's Jabber. She definitely posted something from here. Then where the hell is she? Her notebook is here too. I'm going to take a look. Anything stands out? Her place is a mess. There are stuff all over the floor. She's really fussy about keeping things organized. A robbery? Her laptop is still here. Nothing else is missing. What did you hear? I have no idea what I just heard. Listen for yourself. Oh lord. Oh. Thank you for the host, soccer. Sounds like talking. It's kind of creepy. All of this just doesn't feel right. Something weird is going on. Damn it. How are you something something? Uh, I don't like any of these, but ghosts. That is your explanation? Do you know how stupid that sounds? Wait. <laughs> Found something on her computer. Oh god. Help! Whoa, what's up? Phone's gonna reset. Yeah! Okay. I'm on a clock! What the hell? Calm the fuck down. I have 87 seconds. Tell me what is happening. You said data is resetting or something. How did it happen? From Anna's laptop. Okay, hang on. Let me just check her laptop. Shit! I see it too. Remotely delete all data? How the fuck that happened? I didn't touch anything. I can't do anything here. Just give me a second. Fuck, I can't remember how to work this. It's the same software she got for me. Tell me what you see. Shit. Hang on. I see it. Oh, fuck me. To turn it off, I need to answer some security questions. There are three. Her cat's name, her company's name, her Iris OS version's name. Oh, uh, uh, Toby. Uh, her company's name is... to bot to Damn it, Tobias! <sighs> and we're done. Wow. Wow. That's it? Fucking lost. Shit, man! Let's name it after me. Cat. 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 Damn it. Cat. Cat. Hello, cat cat. 
For more personalized user experience, please answer the following questions. Let's get started. How old are you? 31. Where's your home country or region? USA? Are you a new user or experienced user? Experience I can't even fucking talk. Uh new. If needed, would you like to manually configure new settings or allow the phone to do it for you? Auto. Uh occasional. Sleep late. What's your favorite kind of smell? This is gonna be weird, but <laughs> gasoline. <laughs> That is because my grandma owned a gas station, and when I was a kid, I grew up around the gas station, and I like the smell of gasoline because it reminds me of her business. So it's not weird and freaky; it's it's actually sentimental. Which part of the animal do you prefer to eat? The thigh. Saddest moment in life. Uh. Uh, rel relative dying. You have to tell me more. From cancer. What? How, how do I have to tell you more? Like, really? Uh... Um family member lost her life to brain cancer. How is that okay? <laughs> Are you paranoid that your phone or laptop camera might be recording your every move? No. If everyone can only tell the truth all the time. Do you think this will make the world a better or worse place? Better. Do you swear to tell the truth the whole... Sure. Would you rather know the date of your death or the cause of your death? Uh... I don't know. Either would be terrible. Um... The... Pause. I want it to be quick. Would you rather lose your mind or all your limbs? Mind. If you look behind you right now, would you rather see a floating disembodied head or a headless body? Uh... Nothing, honestly. A headless body, I guess. What? No! You agree to surrender all of your personal data to Iris OS for the further improvement? Oh my god. There's nothing behind me. I can see the camera, Giant Toro. I can see the camera on my screen over here. There's nothing behind me. <laughs> you can't fool me. Sure. It's not really... Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Instead of that's all, folks. Thank you. Your phone is now ready to be used. Oh boy. Hi, cat, cat. Welcome to Chats, your default messaging app powered by Iris. The service is complimentary for one year from this day. After that, a yearly subscription fee will be charged. We hope to be of continuous service to you. Remember, we are always watching over you. Your chat ID is cat87. That's creepy because it wanted my age, so it figured out my the year I was born. <laughs> Always watching over you. Oh, well, we don't have any kind of thing. I have two wallpapers. Uh oh. Do I have contacts? I have just emergency services. Oh! You! You! Message corrupted. Uh, 
are you safe? You, you, are you safe? Who is this? Don't you recognize me? It's voice. Do not. Uh. You need to tune it out. Who is voice? Yeah, the time is going all ballistic. The one, the many, it's voice, it's voice. Do not believe it. You must resist its words. Resist what? Its image, it's a lie. must have seen it. <laughs> it didn't even have to be jumbled. Something... This. Something is wrong. You are not Anna. Nope. This is not Anna. No, 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 no. Anna! She will soon be gone. No. She will be gone soon. How do I find her? It depends on it. Find her and you will find me. Or find me and you will find her. Oh. Is that comforting? If not. Oh boy. Um... at me now she wasn't looking at me before she was looking down this is creepy from the office of admissions the university of cunningham we have received your application to the school of veterinary science we regret to inform you that you have not been shortlisted blah 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 we thank you blah 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 they didn't even say why, and they have to take three months for this? <laughs> Ugh, this is not helping! Oh boy. I've been there. It sucks. So we didn't lose her stuff. Make sure you get it right next. Hello? Fuck. Please tell me it works. If the data is gone, I'm going to fucking kill you. I cannot lose it, Anna. The data is still here, I think. Thank God. Oh God. You fucking scared me. I thought we are going to lose 
our progress. Uh, that's what I thought. Did you hear that? Or was that just me? It was like a noise. I keep hearing that every so often. I thought it was just something before, but I definitely heard it that time because I turned my volume up a bit. Are you sure you didn't trigger it? I told you I didn't touch anything. This is too much weirdness for one day. Okay, here it is. I found something on her laptop. More clues? Something like that. There's some phone data backed up. One here. Another one at her workstation. That means there might be more stuff on the phone than what you see now. We work with what we have. I'm restoring from her laptop first. Let's get started. I mean, I'm already vested into this, so... Oh! It's starting. Uh-oh. Should be done now. Did you get it? Great. More of Anna to see. Hey. Tone down the creep factor. There is something else. I was looking through her notebook. Is there something you are not telling me? What are you implying? It says in her notebook that she met someone on Spark. Didn't you mention that she matched with some people on Spark? Yeah, it's Taylor. So you've been talking to this guy all this time? How much have you told him? This is very selective. You better not be lying. Did anyone ever thought you not to trust everything people say, especially if it's online? Fucking basic common sense shit. You're a stranger too. <laughs> Eat your words. I'm her fucking boyfriend, so you better stop listening to this crap and do as I say. Stay on the line. I'm going to make some calls. Get to the bottom of the spark thing. Jesus. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Today's going to be an interesting day. I can feel it. The fuck? Haven't seen you in a while. Where have you been? Yeah, where have you been? It's not like you to miss Jim. I'm fine. Just got caught up with work. That's all. Going to take a short break. Don't worry about me. What? Oh god. Oh god. All the chats. Do I literally have to scroll through all this? Whoa. Greg recovered. Okay, so this is new. Hey, since it was the cat's birthday yesterday, when is your birthday again? If I can get close to the ne if I can close the next client, you're in for a treat. You keep calling it the cat. It has a name, you know. You're avoiding the question. I know the month. You get three guesses and if you screw all of them up, you let me drive your car. No. Yes. Just ask Ashley. No cheating. Texting her. No, I win. I will get you for this. You will regret this day. Count your friends and fort your pillows. For you will need every comfort in the years ahead. Yes, I do not pity you at all. Ha ha. Hey, are we boring? What do you mean? When we were out last night, it was like everyone was 20-something and they had some kind of futuristic job. A founder of a startup, game programmer, neuros neuroscience researcher. You work at a surveillance company. I know. Not what I mean. Like, we just mainly go out, chill, chill plus Toby. You're a salesman, and I work stupid big data bullshit. Are we basic? Are we norm core? White bread? I'm a salesman, so no question there. Dodging the question. 75% chance that at any given time, we are the most boring couple in the room, but who cares? Are you bored of me? What? Fuck no. Where'd that come from? It's been bothering me. Last night you didn't really want to dance, and I know you don't like dancing like I do anyway, but like you seemed kind of upset about it. 
Haha, no, I was just kind of tired. Yeah? Yes. Can we... Did you see that? Can we hang out again tonight? I think maybe work stuff is getting to me. I can't. Why? Work. I guess maybe I'll hang with Ashley, Kay. You'd tell me, right? Tell what? If you're hiding something. I told you your present only comes on your birthday. It's not that. You are acting weird. You always say I'm a weirdo. Weirder than usual. An example would help. I don't know, just a gut feeling. You're overthinking things. Promise me, promise me that everything is fine. What's gotten into you? Just do it, please. Okay, I promise. Everything is fine. I love you. Hey, you're mad. I can tell. You don't just storm out of the house without saying anything. Tell me. Tell me what? <clears throat> or tell what? I want you to tell me why do you think I'm mad? Tell what? Oh boy. This is what she was talking about before. So. Um. Er. Nope. Damn it. This, this. Oh. Oh. Paris, wait. Paris and Kane, extension 40405. Yolanda? XOXO. XO. Oh boy. Uh, who the hell is Yolanda? You looked through my phone. I knew something was up. You could have fucking told me. How long were you going to wait? Fuck. I made a mistake. I can explain. Please do. She was the client I need for last month's target. We met a few times after work. She, She's persistent. I made a mistake. I own that. But everything after that was not me. Bullshit. Anna. Oh, God, another one. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. She's pregnant? Oh, fuck. Um. How do I? Um. Shit. Uh. Shit. There we go. It oh, it's inconclusive. Have to try again tomorrow. You cheated on me. And almost got her pregnant. Holy fuck. This is unreal. I told you I'm not allowed to just get rid of clients. You're not allowed to fuck clients. She was the last clothes I needed. I know it's hard to believe. I don't fucking care. Anna, leave me the fuck alone, Greg. Anna, let me fix this. 
he fucked a client to close some deal and almost got her pregnant. I just heard something and I'm not sure if it was real life or it sounded like something moved to my left. That was a little eerie. You heard? Okay, so it's not. <laughs> okay, because I looked over here because there's open space over here. and There's like a bunch of like shelves and stuff. And I'm like, did something fall? Okay, so that wasn't just me then. Cool. Um, he's been calling me for a few days. I have, n I've not been responding. Should I come over? I don't know. I keep going back and forth between being angry at him and feeling guilty about being so upset. Hugs. Toby is the only lover I need. First woman desperate enough to upright marry their cat. Time to enter the fringes of society, Ashley. Time to be cat wife. Do you, Anna, take Tobias the cat as your lawfully wedded husband? To have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, until death do us part. Yes, I do! This sounds terrible. Leave my shit jokes alone. Okay, so I'm gonna call you later, okay? Yeah, okay. Heart. Hey, how are you feeling, pretty girl? Bag of rocks, bag of those bricks made of poop they dry out in developing desert communities. They use them to build amazing houses with decent insulation and stabilize a small rural economy. And the nonprofit takes a glammy picture of the whoever people and the CEO and you feel weird because you're like, is this picture boasting about helping people or is it promoting the CEO and their self-interest somehow? And in the background of the pic, there are unused extra poop bricks, which will get rained on, return to a former but lesser poop form, and eventually dry out in the sun, leaving nothing but a stain. I am that stain. I've been reading a lot. Call me if you need to, okay? Hey there, handsome. Who, me? How you doing? About the same. Let's hang out tomorrow. I don't know. I'm pretty content in my angry, lonesome hole. Got a good book rhythm going, you know? Boldrillard is a is way ahead of his time. Who am I going to trust now when I turn on the TV? Why won't you hang out with me tomorrow? Hang out with me. I am hotter than your cultural commentary. Eh. Be my date. It'll, I'll be a good date. We'll get pretty and we'll go out on the town. Eh. Come on. Are you alright? What's gotten into you? Hello? Hey, um... God. I just read my text. I'm so, so sorry. Can you do me a favor and just ignore all of it? <laughs> I had a wee bit too much to drink last night and I have no idea what I was saying. I'll make it up to you, okay? I'm going back to sleep, so I'll catch you soon, all right? Oh, okay. Ashley's got the hots, I guess. Mail. Anna, hey, I got your application, but the boss is sitting on it for now. It's regarding that thing you brought up. Text me when you're in the office and I will explain. Best regards, Elizabeth. I'm following up on the application of my two-week study leave. I have not heard from you since. I totally understand if it's not approved. I just need to know so I can prepare. Okay. Uh, so she ordered the Consumer Society Myths and Structures and the Singular Objects of Architecture. Rainforest count <laughs> instead of Amazon. Rainforest. Good thinking. Hey Anna, looks like you're my receiver for the next week's company gift swap. I know gifts are meant to be a secret, but I don't like giving gifts that you ultimately don't want, so I'm breaking tradition and will get you something that you truly deserve. Oh boy. Oh my. Tell me...
your dress size and I will pick pick the perfect body for you <laughs> no um tell me oh god it's creepy your body size and I will pick the perfect dress for you. Oh god. Oh god, why? Oh. You somehow managed to look so hot in office wear. So why not I get you a smashing office dress? Tell me your body size and I will pick the perfect dress for you. Make sure you give your bust, waist, and hip measurements. I want to get it right the first time. A sheath dress would be perfect with a tr with a tighter and firmer bust to pair with those long legs. You would look fabulous. Some might say it's distracting, but if you have assets, you have to show it. What the fuck? Oh my god! This this is like against all company like shit. And he's emailing on his work email. Wow, this guy could totally get fucking... Oh my god. This is terrible. This is terrible. I feel so bad for her. When your life is worth money. Oh, yeah. This is, uh, this is totally what I want to read when... I'm missing, and yeah, spark. Hey, stranger, anything? Anna posted something on Jabber. Looks like she's chilling at your home. I guess she's all right. Far from it. You know, maybe you're overthinking it. Maybe she just want to be left alone. Shouldn't be make jokes right now. Sorry. I'm all ears. What's up? So what happened? Did Greg check her house or something? What about the post? He did, but no sign of her. And I would have called her phone by now if she's okay. And somehow she makes a point exactly the same time when Greg is checking in on her. Doesn't it sound a bit strange to you? Ocum's Razor Ocam? What? The op- Oh, this fucking light in the background. The obvious answer is most often true. The easiest answer is most often right. I don't know. That. Eh, close enough. So let's say, hypothetically, there's a possibility that Greg somehow did something bad to Anna, and he is hiding it from you. Or you did something bad to Anna, and you're hiding it from me. Just a random thought. Oh. What if Anna is deliberately trying to get away from Greg? Maybe he bombarded her with calls and messages to the point where she just went, screw it, and chucked the phone away. Why would you say that? I got my reasons, but think about it. What kind of person Greg is? Kind of a dick? Anna is a pretty sweet gal. Why would she date someone like him? Being verbally abusive is not far from being physical. He got blocked from her apartment. I don't know how much of this I should be saying. Aha, if they are indeed lovebirds, at most he won't have the keys, 
But getting blocked is a strong word. Maybe she's keeping him away. Sure, let's make things worse. This is troubling. Is trying to disrupt is trying to obstruct justice? I think he's hiding something big in the phone. Otherwise, why would he want to delete the phone's data? I heard that. I heard that. I don't like the fact that I hear that. And I don't see it. Okay. That's a little creepy. Yeah, someone just gasped. I don't think he did it. Said every guilty person ever. All I'm saying is I think there's more to Greg than he is leading on. Again, hypothetical. What else he told you? And I met someone on Spark? Right? There's a possibility that a hawker like Anna will get matched more than once. Yeah, you're right. My cat is gasping. Um, yeah, I would never hide anything from you. Trust me, Scout's Honor. I think before we move on, you need to confront him, call him out. still have to look at some stuff on this phone. Great, he's hiding something. I can feel it. If he did something to Anna, we need to know what it is. Remember to get your facts straight and ask him about his actions and behavior. Maybe he will slip up and tell you something we don't know. Okay. Craig, I need to ask you something. What? I can't see the bottom. Um. Your relationship with Anna. You're a shrink now. What is there to talk about us? Why did she block you from her apartment? We had a f we had fight, okay? How would I know she would block me? I just need to check if she is at home. Uh oh. Sounds like a troubled relationship. It's still breaking and entering. Hey. You helped. At the very least you are an accomplice. Um, let's talk about her place. What about in this place? Did you activate the phone reset? I told you I didn't do anything. Are you calling me a liar? If I wanted the phone erased, why the hell do I back up the phone for you? To gain my trust? Because you screwed up? The only one screwing around is you. Why the sudden interest in me? This is not the time to be pointing fingers. Here I am busting my balls to find her, and you are accusing me. What are you hiding? I hope you're done wasting my time. Let's talk about your attitude. What about my attitude? I have no time to deal with your feelings right now. Sometimes you come off as rude. I am really stressing out over here, okay? It's just, I'm not sugarcoating anything for you. Just deal with it. Okay. I won't, I won't call him out anymore. Watch the sarcasm. What's with these accusations? Make your point. Maybe you are somehow involved. Now why would I ever do that? 
So stop pant painting me as some kind of a bad guy. You have nothing on me. Hello, I'm looking for Anna. I believe this is her number. Hello? Hello? Uh, I think this is the answering machine. I'll just leave a message first. This is Detective Marillo from the police department. Uh oh. We received a report from one of your neighbors. She mentioned that there was a suspicious looking guy entering and exiting your residence. Can you confirm if this is true? Call us if you wish to report a burglary. Thank you and good day. Calm down. I don't have time for this. I'm not going to entertain any more questions about my life. You have nothing on me. Let's watch another vlog. Oh my god. What if I didn't? What if I just went on living a lie? And he can do it looking me dead in the eyes. God, and he hasn't stopped texting me since. What, what does that mean? Does he still love me? Then why would he... You know what? I hope it's positive. I hope she's pregnant. Yeah, he always wanted a family. Now everyone's happy. Everyone's happy. Wow. This is heavy. It's getting really heavy. Some serious detective work going on here. Another random thought. What if Greg killed Anna? Well, maybe kill is a strong word, but what if he hurt her or something and tried to cover it up? And all you hear from him is a lie. What if you're lying? Huh. I don't- I don't want to go that far. Uh... Taylor recovered. Titanic. What? It's my icebreaker. Haha, <laughs> that's cute. People died, though. Yeah, I need to work on that. So, animal person, huh? Dog? Cat. Only one, I hope. One is a handful already. I'm not the crazy cat lady age yet. So, your profile says you serenade upon request. Yup. You sing? Occasionally. Prove it. I got my eyes on you. You're everything that I see. I want your heart, love, and emotion endlessly. I can't get over you. You left your mark on me. I want your heart, love, and emotion endlessly. Oh. Okay. This is why I don't date on apps. This is why. I met someone personally because I socialized in public and I found someone that way and I didn't do this. He does have a good voice, but th that's pretty ballsy. Oh, wow, that's not bad. So is it true that the shower gives better acoustics? Yes, but I have to store the soaps and shampoos if I sing there. Interesting. Why is that? Otherwise, it would be a soap opera. I hate Taylor. I hate him. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, you got me on that one. Do I get something in return? Your number, maybe? I'll think about it. <sighs> Alright, I don't know if I want to... I am so done with Taylor. I'm, I'm over it. And I have to do that thing and... I literally have to do this or I can't progress. Maybe I can just do pictures. Let me do pictures. Look at more pictures. Let's, uh... Working out. Good body. 
Cool. What other pictures we have? We have this one. <clears throat> um... Okay. So there we go. Oops. How do I found? What's that? Okay, she's in a little dress and sneakers somewhere. Creepy. Okay, so that's the- this is the guy who fucked someone and almost got them pregnant for work. I, seriously, just marry the kitty. You'll be fine. Okay. Not much else going on here in pictures. One chat video. Another random thought. Just a random. Okay, so these are just from me. Videos. Oh shit! What? Oh, shit. Oh, did it, like, fall over? <laughs> if you look into my eyes, you can see it looking back. Can you see it? I just wanted to be happy. My name is Anna, my name is I don't want to take anyone else! Anna. My name is Anna, my name is Anna. It's too late for me. Hmm. Okay. So we have to talk. And I left him because he cheated. Ha! Caught red handed. Or red fingered because it's in text. Okay, that sounded weird now that I typed it out. Who is the un. Hello? I heard that. Who is the unlucky girl? Yolanda. Exotic name? You know, it sounds like motive to me. Messy breakup, fight, things got a little violent, who knows? I think you should call her and ask if she knows anything about Greg, like a second opinion. Get it straight from the source. Too scandalous. Hey. I think it's time to give him what he deserves. Remember, we are here for Anna. This is necessary. Find Yolanda. Find the truth. Oh, man. So, how do I find Yolanda? Do I have her in my contact? No. No, I don't. I do not. Um. How do I find Yolanda? Hmm. Oh, maybe in the pictures? Because we have these down here. Perry, is it Ferris and Kane? Or Paris and Kane? 
extension 0405. Let's see. Let's try P. Nothing. A uh, surfer. Um, oh, there we go. Right there. Call now. Welcome to Ferris and Kane, your personal shopper directory. Press one to request for a shopper. Oh, Lord. Press two to ask about being a patron. Press three to find out more about our latest promo. If you wish to return to the main menu at any time, please press zero. Welcome to Ferris and oh, Kane, shit. your personal shopper directory. Press one to request for a shopper. Thank you. To help us select a personal shopper for you, please indicate what you would like to purchase. Press one for robes and cloaks. Press two for dresses. Press three for innerwear. Press four for shoes and footwear. Press five for gowns. If you wish to return to the main menu at any time, please two, cause if you know the extension number of your favorite shopper, because the one guy wanted to buy us a dress. Number. If you wish to be assigned to a random shopper. Thank you. Your personal shopper assigned to you is Yolanda. There we go. For increasing demand, we can only take a limited amount of clients at a time. After this call, please wait for us to text you at our latest convenience. Thank you for picking Ferris and Kane. Have a nice day. Oh God, here we go. Here we go. Yolanda. Hi, Yolanda. Thanks for using Ferris and Kane. My name is Yolanda. I'll be your shopper today. How may I assist you? I need your help for other matters. I'm afraid we do not do returns. You have to contact HQ for that matter. I want to talk to you about Greg. Greg? Summers? Who is this? What did that asshole put you up to? So we both agree on something. So he ruined your life too. The hell else is new? Look, if you're looking for dirt on Greg, I'm not getting involved with him again. Uh, he is looking for... Oh, shit. Um. Well, I can't say he broke in because I let him in. He's looking for Anna. Why do you need me for that? I think he's fully capable of finding that perfect little bitch. Ooh. She's gone missing. As in... Missing? We need to call the police kind of missing? Oh, I see it now. If you're implying that he actually did something to Anna, I highly doubt it. He didn't even have the balls to break up with me face to face. He's too chicken shit to be a criminal. He has two girlfriends. Me, please. More like a side girl booty call. He cheated. Oh, yeah. I am all in for some casual fun, but having a girlfriend all this time, that's a low blow. When she found out about me, all hell broke loose, and I ended up being the other girl. How did it end? When it comes down to making a choice, of course he went for Anna, and I get the half-ass voicemail breakup. Hey, Yolanda, I got your text. So, you know, now that the scare is over, I think we should stop seeing each other. Like, 
immediately. It's not just that it's, you know, it's been fun, but I haven't been completely honest with you. I have a girlfriend, and I want to make things work with her. We agreed to keep it casual, right? I hope you're not mad or anything, eh? No hard feelings. What a dick! What a dick! <laughs> a whorehopper. Together, that looks like Whopper. Like, wow, what a Whopper. He is a two-timing bastard. So he is. At the end of the day, he still cares about her. If only he knows how to show it. Now everyone thinks I'm a bad person. He fooled all of us. If I knew he had a girlfriend, I would have stopped immediately. Stupid me. I hope that was helpful. I gotta get back to work now. Thanks, Yolanda. Sorry you had shit. Um. The fuck? Oh boy. New vlog available. Oh god, all the things. Let's watch. What is love? Love is being there. Love is being honest. Love is being belonging. Love is patience. Love is <laughs> Love hurts. Okay. What's your deal? Seriously, where is your head at? Yolanda just called me. Just wanted to know the full story. No. I don't care about your excuses. You have crossed a line. She's pissed and confused. And you brought her into this mess. Had to be sure. My personal affairs has nothing to do with you, whoop de doo I cheated on Anna. Now it's out in the open. Would you stop digging into my life and get back on track? Only because you ask so nicely. <laughs> just stop and use your head for just one second. Have you ever considered that what's-his-face from Spark is just sticking you around? Come on, what do you really know about him? I thought about it. He makes a lot of lewd jokes. What kind of nutcase will joke about someone going missing? It's like he lacks any kind of empathy. He did sidetrack- I don't like how clear and distinct that is! Holy shit! I, that made me uncomfortable. That really made me uncomfortable here. Oh my god. Whew! I got scared of that one. I don't like that. That's not cool. So pointing the finger at me was his idea all along. And you said that I am the one with things to hide. I won't be surprised if he had some kind of criminal record. Whew. Yes. Yes. This is an entire clusterfuck of shit. A nice guy if you can overlook those things. You disagree? I'm not the only one who thinks he's dangerous. Look what I found. Spark-related crimes soars increasing number of felons. Use dating apps to target victims. Of course, it's, it's nothing new. You're just basically giving like a generic like, wow, the internet is very unsafe kind of thing. 
it is talking about the recent rise in spark related crimes. There is a link at the bottom that brings you to a registry site. Sounds horrible. And true. You said that Anna matched with several people on Spark. Anna's notebook mentioned that she met someone. I can feel we are getting close. Punch in all the names of her Spark matches. See what you can find. So... Whoa! Okay, that was a thing. Um, so Taylor, uh, Taylor Pereira. Okay, so. Let's try this out. If John walked up behind me and scared me, I would just piss myself. I'm not even kidding. Um, Taylor. Pereira. Found six matches. Um... So he's 22. He works at Fine Studios. He's 22. Where did he live? Did someone catch that? God damn it. I don't know where he lives. Can I ask him? It just says Taylor Pereira. 22. Oh yeah, that's right. He does have a jabber. Okay. Jabber. Taylor, there he is. How do I, how do I jabber? J jabber from Springwood. Springwood, is Springwood a place? Springwood. Um. Twenty-two. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Taylor Pereira, 22, Springwood. Open and gross lewdness and las lascivious behavior. Indecent exposure and public sexual indecency. So open and gross lewdness and behavior. So it just kind of sounds like he likes to get freaky. It doesn't sound like he kills people, but he's still a problem. Uh, how do I approach this? Shit. I spoke to you to Yolanda. Or should I lie with him? Hmm. Whoa, who's that? Someone walked by me on the sidewalk and said hello, freak. 
Okay. <sighs> I guess we'll start with Yolanda. You did it, buddy. So what is it? Lover, not a fighter. So Greg is not the violent type, I assume. I guess my theory about Greg making it and disappears too far-fetched. He's clean. Sure Greg didn't let anything slide? Can your source even be trusted? Oh, defamation is a crime. Whoa. That's not my intention. I just think he's hiding something, that's all. You weren't completely honest with me. What are you talking about? Oh, God. You found it, didn't you? You have, if you have something to say, spill it. You're a registered sex offender. Shit. I knew it. You found the damn registry, didn't you? I know it looks really bad. <clears throat> a guy on Spark being a sex offender is as bad as it gets, but hear me out, please. What did you do? You have to believe me. It's an accident. I'll make it quick. I want... Uh, just keep it short. I don't want to hear about... So, too long didn't read. It was all a misunderstanding. Someone caught me with my pants down in the public place. End of story. Oh, that's not... Okay, I changed my mind. Tell me more. Sigh. Okay, so I was at a mall and I had a huge glass of iced tea right before and I got a pee real bad. The bathroom was closed on the floor I was on and the next one was really far away. And then... So I went into the, st the starway? The starway and peed there. Then this lady with her kid came through the door. I was exposed. Next thing you know, lawyers were involved and I was charged. So that was that was your only crime? You gotta believe me. You could technically call me a criminal, but I would never harm another person. Come on, you could trust me. Uh I guess it could happen to anyone? Tell me about it. I mean, you'd be surprised how little you can get in trouble. I have to follow so many strict rules from the not safe for work that I'm practically branded. Do you know how hard it is to find a job? Sounds awful. I'm just keeping my head low. If I mess up, it's straight to jail for me. I would never do anything remotely illegal, so let's keep this between you and me says the guy I'm texting this is just really bizarre it's a real conversation starter don't play with me on this I'm serious okay so oh shit shit I can't believe you actually did it. I just told you not to tell anyone. I didn't do anything. Greg. He added me on Jabber. Oh, he's definitely pissed. How the hell he find me? I might have told him about you. God damn it. Oh shit, he added me on his phone. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
Taylor got you. Now, you sex maniac. What the who is this? How the hell did you get my number? Shut up, rebound guy. I am the one Anna should be with. You stay out of this, Greg. That escalated quickly. <laughs> How the hell did you get my number? The internet is a resourceful place, especially for finding pervs like you. Wow, from cheating to stalking. Can someone hand him the best boyfriend of the year award? What I do in my private life is none of your business. You're the one who drove her away in the first place. How about I drive my foot up your dick hole? <laughs> Uh, I think you guys are missing the point of all of this. We are all on board until shit for brain showed up. Look, man. Anna wanted to move on. Why can't you respect that? She'd be better with literally anyone else but you. So Mr. I can't keep my pants up is somehow an acceptable choice for her? At least I don't have a criminal record. That's a low blow, man. Enough. <laughs> he eats popcorn. <laughs> I'm only adding you here to be a witness, so shut it. What the hell did you do to Anna? If you touch her... How can I do anything if I haven't even met her yet? She mentioned that she is meeting someone from Spark on her notebook. Have you ever considered that there are literally millions of other lonely single men out there? Of course I did, and I'm starting with you. That is not working, Smart. I just want her back. There's a smarter way to do this. We are wasting time here. Now that you made it so clear, don't we all want the same thing? Same thing. Different reasons. Finally, we are agreeing on something. No, I am not agreeing with you. You are the one that accused me and threw everyone off. Hey. It's not my fault that she left you. We are all to be blamed. Agreed. Debatable. If you're going to be like this, fine. I can prove that I didn't meet Anna. Fan fucking tastic. Show me. My spark messages. It's all there. It will prove that Anna and I never planned to meet. Yeah. I mean, I read them. They didn't meet up. He is telling the truth. No. I want to see it with my own eyes. Can you be any more insecure? Her phone. She cleared some data not long ago. And she backed it up on her home computer and the one at work. If I can access it, it will give all the proof I need. Whoa. I think you're on to something. We do that. We might be able to know who she met on Spark. Damn, that's true. Finally. Focus on what matters. <laughs> Guys done fighting? No. <laughs> yes. What? Not until I see the messages. G's fine. Maybe we can somehow call her office, ask around for help, get someone to get her computer or something. What kind of a shitty idea is that? I say I just walk right in and get it myself. It's going to be easy. Let's call her office, because the cops are looking for Greg. Excellent. Maybe she has friends that we can trick into getting her computer. We wasted enough time already. I'm not playing charades to get something that important. Are you doubting me? I'm just proposing alternatives. Should we discuss this? I'm. I've done listening to you. I'm... Just going to walk in and get the job done, plain and simple. That's too reckless. Let's find a more indirect way in. Let's just call one of our work friends. I know her better. She has no work friends. And what makes you think you can use your computer so easily? Oh, uh, Greg's idea is better. I don't know. Shit. I meant Taylor. Fuck! I fucked it up! I got mixed up on the guys, even though their names are right there! Whatever. Let him get arrested. 
Oh, come on. You and I both know it won't work. Why don't you trust my plans? I'm not playing games with your jokers anymore. Do as you please. I'm going anyways. But we're making so much progress. I'm not working with the rebound guy. I'm going to find Anna by myself. Go get the backup from her workplace your way. I'll do mine, I swear. If she did end up meeting you, you won't hear the end of it. Oh, boy. <sighs> Damn it! Okay, so that just happened. That was unexpected. Look, sorry for the outburst. It's not meant for you. I just want to make things right. And I gotta do it. If we met under other circumstances, maybe we would have got along. I doubt it, but there is a possibility. There, I said it. Okay. A lead is a lead. We need to know who Anna, who is Anna is close with at work. Did you manage to check her emails? If you can read them all, that would be great. There's a guy harassing her. Harassment. Nailed it. We can use this. Are you up for some blackmail? What are you implying? Use that email against him. Tell him that you're turning him in. Threaten him. Make him feel bad. I don't know. Ask him to do your bidding in exchange for the harassment email. Sounds pretty wrong. <laughs> Two wrongs make a right, man. Just do it, okay? Jesus Christ. Oh, it works. <laughs> sorry, sorry. N no need to respond. I uh, just want to try to call Anna's phone, see if it's working. Been trying to get it, and I, I finally did. I guess next is to find her? Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Bye. That was pointless. Okay. Cool. Who's texting me? Sorry, last one real quick. You sound a little off. I'm just getting this feeling that there's something you're not telling me. I just want to remind you that you can tell me anything. You know that, right? No matter what, I'll still be here. Okay? Feel better soon. I've decided to not call Victor back. You remember him right? The guy from the club? Yep. I'm thinking he's just not right for me. Don't feel a connection, you know? Yeah, forget about him. Am I too picky? Is there something wrong with me? I love you just the way you are. Of you too. <laughs> we should totally get together soon, okay? Sure. I can speak at girlfriend. Uh oh. I'm gonna be your giver for the gift swap. You're gonna love what I have in mind for you. Hello, lover boy. Anna! Where have you been? Everyone's been looking for you. I need a favor. You never asked me for anything before. What gives? I need you to get a phone backup from my PC. Using another employee's PC is against policy. Why can't you do it yourself? I have to attend a family emergency? That can't be right. Shit. You are not Anna, aren't you? Fuck, I should have known. Okay, we are done. Your flirting methods deserve to be published. Blackmail? Is that what's happening? 
You know I can get sued for sharing company secrets, right? If you still want access to Anna's computer, I'm not doing it. If I post your emails all over Jabber. God fucking damn it. Because HR, he probably has some strings to pull at work. Fine, you win. Looks like I'm screwed either way. I need to get a password reset for her PC, but HR will text her phone to verify. You have to pretend to be Anna, otherwise they will never give me access. Easier said than done. You were doing a bang-up job earlier. Just get this over and done with, okay? Oh boy. Okay. 